What's up, everybody? This is your girl, Sugary Girl Candy 2012, and I'm bringing you guys another story. Um, I apologize for not having any videos up for the past, I believe, two weeks, but um, I've been extremely busy and um, a bit stressed out from a lot of things just happening all at once, you know, basically um, family-related things, and it's been really stressful and it's like, um... I haven't been sleeping that well or anything like that. So as you can tell, it's like 12, 24 a.m. And I haven't been sleeping too good because I've just been so freaking stressed and have like too many things running through my mind right now. So, you know, I got to like do stuff in order for me to, I don't know. But let me get on to this because I don't want to make this video about that but if you read the title um <clears throat> you pretty much already know what this is about say xbox one titanfall bundle and 13 months of xbox live 450 dollars at target drops the console's price down to 330 dollars okay before i say anything on it i'm gonna read a bit <laughs> and then like yeah okay so it says the discounts and special offers on the xbox one titanfall bundle seems seems to no end and target just came up with a new one offering the bundle in 13 months one in the box plus 12 extra of xbox live gold for 4.99 for 4.49 excuse me this basically brings the cost of the console to 330 dollars counting the price of the game and if the xbox live gold subscription 59.99 each at target if you want to grab one you can find it here you need to add the item to your cart in order to see the discount price. The discounted price. It's definitely hard to imagine a better or offer less than five months after the release of a console. If you were on the fence about purchasing an Xbox One, this might tip you over. Okay. Okay, is this a picture or is this a link? Okay, this is a picture. But as you guys can see from this picture, um, this is basically what it it says it costs but when you add it to your car it's gonna be that price that was mentioned so well I don't know this picture ain't really showing it but that's what they said but let me go back <sighs> okay so um okay basically that was all okay that wasn't really much of an article was it <laughs> so this video won't be too long okay but anyway as you guys read that part this is a good and bad thing Okay, let me start out with the good thing. Um, the good and the bad. The good thing is um, now it's cheaper for many who wanted to pick it up. Um, Microsoft might be able to actually get some consoles off the shelf. Because, I mean, you would think with Titanfall being bundled with the console and all that stuff. You know, because, you know, this is, that was like, that has to be like one of the most hyped up games. This, gen this like. 2014 so far and you can't really say it wasn't because I'm sure within like every game site you went to there they had it in a little ad on the corner I know it's personally for me with every gaming site that I personally went to there was a Titanfall ad somewhere even going on Twitter I couldn't escape it because it was trending on the side and I'm like damn <laughs> this don't is hyped up and it was funny that like a few were saying it's not hyped up it wasn't hyped up and they were trying to say that the game called 1886 for the PlayStation 4 was hyped up yet we just like got a, a, a second trailer of it like three months ago three or two months ago and people were saying that's overhyped basically they were saying that was overhyped because we didn't see any gameplay of it and I'm like what <laughs> like that was crazy I ain't never heard of a game that you haven't played before being overhyped I don't know but anyway good thing is they might actually be able to get some consoles off the shelves and it might entice more people to actually pick it up and you know they might get some sales from it and you know in case they ever wanted one now they can get one because it's cheaper but um the negatives of this whole situation is the fact that you know when uh companies usually drop a console down uh so early on in its life cycle and um it either means a sign of desperation I hate to say it like that or um, it means it means or well, obviously they're not moving enough off the shelf and another negative thing that comes off of this is how will this affect uh, ugh, excuse me damn like how will this affect their uh, their profit like with them cutting it like this will they be able to make any money from this because you know we all know how um, 
the whole PlayStation 3 thing is. I mean, the PlayStation 3 thing was when Sony, uh, you know, was losing money and, you know, they wasn't, they didn't start making money till what, like, midway throughout the PS3's life cycle. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's a good and a bad thing. Um, the price cut is pretty enticing because it's actually cheaper than the PlayStation 4 right now. <laughs> So it's actually enticing enough to pick it to pick it up, but you know, when you think out think about how they started, you're like, I don't know. But uh, hold on, I'm looking at this crazy ass commercial on TV right now. Okay, wow. Okay, let me stop. <laughs> so awkward. Okay, so um. What was I just saying? Uh, it's a good and it's a bad thing. Um, Cause, you know, they might be. Uh, oh yeah, a lot of people's like, um, oh you guys shouldn't be angry at this. You guys sh should be clamoring at the fact that it's got a price drop and stuff. And fail to realize that the people that are upset are the people that actually bought the Xbox One like full price and come to find out the price will be dropped like you know to three hundred and thirty dollars and the people that don't have an xbox one can now get it cheaper and so you know what i'd be a little upset too because i ain't even gonna lie and i got my ps3 at uh four hundred dollars i was mad as shit when they brought out came out with another uh edition and it was cheaper than the one i own like i really don't freaking like when companies do that when you bought a console for the most ex one of the most expensive prices and then they come along the lines and you know sell it cheaper except with microsoft they're actually doing it pretty quick because it's only been like what five months now counting april was six months since the console just released and it's already had like what three price drops but at the same time it's just been like uh it's not like a uh within a whole it's just been like various uh, uh uh stores and stuff doing price uh price drops like uh sometimes you'll hear about it GameStop doing it and you'll hear hear about Walmart doing it doing it or something like that though I haven't heard about Walmart doing it yet but you know what I mean so uh my overall thoughts basically that was it um it's a good thing because, you know, it'll get the consoles selling quicker. It'll actually probably entice people that don't own one to get one now. Um, the negatives, uh, the fact that it's had, uh, like, what, three price drops already within the months that it's been out, not even that long, is kind of a sign of desperation. And uh, the fact that they might not be making much of a profit because they're going to be selling the consoles obviously at a loss as with as with how Sony did when the PlayStation 3 came out and it was out for the first few years and stuff they were selling it at a huge freaking loss so um, basically yeah that's pretty much it um, you guys can leave your thoughts down below and tell me what you think of this whole situation do you personally think it's a sign of desperation that the price of the consoles being dropped once again do you think this is a good thing um now that it's 330 dollars at tight at a uh, target though it may not last it probably it's probably not going to last considering it's only for the titanfall bundle do you think you would be do you think you would pick one up now because it's at this price and yeah that's basically it leave your comments down below let me know what y'all think and i'll be sure to get back to your comments as fast as i can deuces